Hey there folks, Lane here with Windows10Update.com back with another quick tip for you to help you with your Windows 10 system. Now today I want to talk about how to clear extra space off of your hard drive so that you can make room for other things that you might need. So there are a couple different ways that you can do this. So first of all, you can go into your modern settings application, go into system, and then go over here to storage. Now, what this will do here is it'll show you how much free space you have on each of the different drives that are connected. Uh, and then you can look down here and see that there are different ways to save applications or documents, music, etc., to different places. So if you do have music that you download, you want to go ahead and download that somewhere else, like perhaps an SD card, you will have that option. Now, if you don't see these options here yet, that may be because you're not on the latest build here. Um, if you're not on 10565, you can do that by getting into the Windows Insider Preview Program. Or of course, you can wait until it rolls out to other users. Um, who knows how long that will take. Uh, the other option that you have here is you can go ahead into your hard drive and actually take a look and see what applications, um, documents, pictures, etc. cetera, what, what is actually taking up all the space that's on your hard drive. And then you can go and clear things that you do not need. Now this may of course take a little bit of time. It's scanning your hard drive, trying to find out what everything is and where it is. Um, so that will take some time, but once you figure it out, you can go into a system that uh, is taking up, uh, or a piece of your system that's taking up a lot of space, and then you can go and find out if there's anything that you can clear there. So you can see in system files here, we do have some important things that we cannot remove, uh, but still nice maybe to know exactly what's taking up space there. Now apps and games, you can go in here, see which applications are the largest. If you aren't using some of those applications, you can go ahead and delete them. But you may come in here and be surprised to find out what is taking up so much space. Like for instance, do I really have 11 gigabytes of video uh, on my system? Apparently I do. So I could go and maybe clear some of those videos that I do not need any longer. So that can be helpful. That's one way that you can do that. Another thing that you can do is actually go into disk cleanup. Now, many of you probably know about this, but it's important to take a look at it anyway for those that do not. So if you just search for disk cleanup in Cortana, select the drive that you want to clean up, and then go ahead and say OK. It's going to find temporary files all over your system that can be safely removed without creating any damage. So you can see there is actually 1.27 gigabytes of temporary internet files here. And I just ran a system cleanup uh, maybe a few days ago. So now this is something that you can do occasionally to clear out space. Um, so if you are running low on memory and you haven't done this for a long time, you may actually find that there's quite a bit that you can clear out. Now another thing that you can do if you have just updated to maybe the latest build of Windows 10, if it's running stably enough for you, you can actually delete a backup of the previous version of the operating system. So before I was on 10565, I was on 10558, and that is gonna be about 12 gigabytes. So if you have updated to a recent version, then you'll wanna go into disk cleanup and hit, and, uh, hit clean up system files. And this is actually a completely different function. It's gonna look, in addition to these files here, it will look on your system for more critical files and give you the option to delete those as well. Um, so again, if you have not done that in a long time, you may, even if you don't need extra space, you could just do this for kicks and you may be surprised, you may be able to clear out 10, 15, 20, even 25 gigabytes of space that could be used for things that are completely unnecessary to have on your system. So just a quick tip for you there on clearing out space so that you can use your system fully. Thanks for watching.